Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is something that I just did super recently on my channel, a video or two back. And I mentioned there would be a part two because it's definitely really needed. So today I'm gonna be finishing up my spring cleaning of my closet and my wardrobe that I started. I did a video of it, like I said, and I will have that linked underneath. So if you haven't watched it, go watch that video first and then come back to follow up on that on this video. But I did get most of the stuff that I didn't get on camera in the other video done already because it was just in the way of my life and everything around me. I have one section of my wardrobe left to get through and kind of clear out and that is my bathing suits. I thought this would be the perfect part to get a part two of like my spring cleaning done with you guys because right now is just about the time that the weather starts to get really nice where I live and I wanna buy new bathing suits and kind of just start fresh. I haven't bought new bathing suits in like I think two years so everything I have is kind of pretty old so I'm hoping to get rid of a lot of it so we're gonna get that done today I feel like this one is gonna be kind of more fun and easier to get through than the last one because the last one I just had shit absolutely everywhere and it was just a mess and really disorganized and I was flustered and overwhelmed and everything else but this time I went ahead before I started filming and I organized all my bathing suits I have a ton of bikini sets that were totally not arranged with the correct top and bottom they were all just thrown into a pile so I got everything laid out in front of me by the set and I'm just gonna go through look at each one look at the condition it's in what it looks like if I'm really still vibing with it and then we'll decide if it'll stay or go so yeah I'm just gonna get right into it it's pretty self-explanatory and if you watch the first one you already know what the vibe of the video is gonna be so let's get started I'm like flustered already. I don't know where to start. Buy what's closer to me and then we'll move back, I guess. That's the best way to do it. So we'll start super basic. I just have this plain black bikini. This is basically just the average string tie bikini. It has like the triangle top, obviously. I feel like this is like a staple bikini for everyone to have just cause it's plain black. You can mix and match with anything basically, but I honestly really just like the combo together. Easy to throw on, just go for a swim, lay out in tan, whatever you're gonna do. So I'm definitely gonna keep this one. I'm not even gonna lie. This is probably a hand-me-down from my older sister, but it's in really good condition. I don't think she ever really wore it. She just didn't want it, so she gave it to me. But if you have older siblings, you understand the hand-me-downs. So I have no idea where this is from or when it was purchased, but I like this, so it's definitely going to stay with me. Next, I have this teal set, and it's kind of got like that ribbed texture and i really really like this one ads aren't too like thick and weird which is like a really big pet peeve of mine when it comes to bathing suits and bikinis and stuff and i like like the outline of it like that on the side the pad looks really weird in there right now but when you have it on it doesn't look that weird it's like shapes my top really nice so i definitely want to keep this top only problem with this set is that the bottom is a very cheeky it's basically thong well it, it really is a thong i'm all for like thong bathing suits obviously it's just something that you have to be you know comfortable with and i don't know sometimes i just don't know like if the thong is for me i definitely don't like a granny panty type of bikini bottom but i definitely do like a slight coverage when it comes to a bikini and being out in public so, like i never really go for this one because it's definitely really cheeky on the bottom and i like to keep sets together rather than mix and match i don't know we'll have to decide if the top is worthy of keeping the whole thing by the way the reason they're all like kind of in a ball when I first bring them up is because I just folded them out but I didn't do it like perfectly because I knew I was going to be like unfolding them to like show you guys and everything so I didn't really fold them neatly so don't judge I'm just getting it done but anyways next one I have is like this tan nude color and I really really like this one except that it has like an underwire like a bra also it broke right here because it has this v in the middle plastic holder in place to like create that shape and that like poked through the material and now it just 
pokes my boob and looks really weird. So this one is gonna go. I already knew that one kind of seen better days. So that one was pretty self-explanatory, but the bottoms are in really good condition and they're cute. I just feel like I don't really have anything that would kind of go with like this plain nude ribbed textured kind of bottom. So I'm just gonna toss the whole thing because they have everything laid out in front of me. It kind of seems like I have a lot of blue and teal colored things, so I definitely need to get rid of a few so I can fill up with some different colors because I'm like overwhelmed with blues right now. So let's get through some of those. So I have this bikini and it's kind of like a cotton candy type of blue. I really, really like the color. It's just really basic, plain and simple. Then it has like a bandeau top, but I definitely am one to take the pads out of bikinis. I kind of just like how they fit and feel better when there aren't pads in there because they tend to get like rolled up and stuff and just like look kind of weird. So the one that's in here will definitely come out. Don't know if this is really cute enough to keep at this point. It's very basic and simple. I really do like the color. So let me know what you guys think of this one. I'm gonna put it in the maybe pile for now. <laughs> other blue kind of teal colored one, it's basically the exact same color as that other one I was debating about. So maybe if I like this one, the other one will go. This top, and I don't know if you can see it very good, but it has like a cute design around the outline of the bikini. This one is like a really nice material bikini and I'm pretty sure this was also a hand-me-down from my sister. A lot of these definitely are. So it has some wear and tear to it. It's definitely a couple years old, plain basic bottom to go with it. Where are different colors? Maybe these don't even go together. I don't even know. I kind of just put them together cause I was going a little fast and they look similar, but might be from two totally different pairs that are just kind of stragglers so i think she's gonna go too said this in my previous spring cleaning type of video that uh, getting rid of my clothes is kind of a challenge for me so that's definitely something i'm dealing with right now but i think i'm doing good this time i already got rid of a few and we didn't even really get through very much so so the next one i have right here is just a top i could not find a bottom for it but i'm really upset about it because i think this top is really really cute piece that's like dangling underneath would be around the back it wouldn't be dangling underneath it's kind of just the way i'm holding it up by the straps i really love the texture of this one i also like that it's white because White makes me look really tan in the summer. I don't have any other white bikinis in front of me, so this is like the only white thing I have. There's just no bottoms, but I think, you know, it's white, so maybe you can mix and match it with something. Who knows? I'm gonna keep it. So I guess when I was buying these bikinis, I was really liking the bandeau type of look because I have a few. And here's another one. I really like the color of this. Purple is my favorite color. It's just like this light lavender kind of purple. And it's got like a little triangle um, embroidered type of design around the edges. Back also, it looks really crazy because it's all scrunched up from being in the drawer. But the back ties up kind of cute in this cute pattern. I would have to like untie it and fix the whole thing but it's kind of cute there are still pads in it so i would have to try it on and like determine if i wanted to keep those in there or not bottoms again are just super basic and just match the top nothing special or crazy about them this set feels like another one that's a really nice material i'm kind of debating keeping it or not because i'm not really into the bandeau style all that much anymore maybe we can make her work i think i'll keep it all right this one that i have is a three-piece set and i already know i'm keeping this because i really really like this and i think i only wore it one time it's just this green zebra print design and it has the little rings on the hips right there which i think is super cute Again, just a matching top with the ring in the middle this time. And then it's got the tie up bikini vibe in the back. Really, really like this one because it also comes with one of these kind of cover up 
waist tie whatever you call them things because i totally forgot what they're actually called perfect for like going to the beach if you don't really plan on getting wet in your bathing suit but still want to have a bathing suit on it goes around your waist and you tie it with the little ends right there so i really love this one the design is super different so i'm glad i have like all three pieces because i wouldn't really be able to match this with anything else most of the bikinis i have left are solid colors i don't really have much designs that i like but i do like this one so she's definitely gonna stay now we have another freaking bando and this one is definitely gonna go because i either ordered the wrong size or when i ordered this i got the wrong size but it's just like huge it might not look that big but your girl doesn't have much going on so this is just, it was just like always really big and then this would like sag down and i just hated how it looked and i never wore it not once and i know i'm not going to i'm not a fan of this shade of yellow really and i just i'm just not vibing with it and it's big it doesn't even fit so bye now we have a red one i'm actually really excited about this one because i totally forgot i ever had this i don't have another red set so i'm trying to like lay it out the right way right now because if i don't hold it up right it's gonna look really weird but like it's like this okay i'm holding it really weird oh shit okay hold on okay so i gotta hold it really weird like this but this is the bottom. Oh, I dropped one. I can't do this, guys. I'm sorry. You get the idea. And then the top is kind of my favorite part because it's just like really interesting. It doesn't give bikini vibes, but I really like that about it, which is kind of weird. It makes it different, you know? So I'm trying to hold this up the right way and I'm just like failing. So kind of you get, you get like that coverage vibe, if you know what I mean. It goes all the way across. And then the straps in the back have a little crisscross moment which is very hard to tell i'm kind of just giving up on holding this one up for you sorry this one's really cute i like the shade of red red is kind of something i struggle to make look good on me but i'm definitely gonna keep this one okay now we got some neon going on here this one looks like a highlighter the top is cute i like the vibe again it's a bandeau i don't know what i was going through with bandos at the time period of buying all of these but there's so many this one's cute it's the only neon colored thing i kind of really have here but i'm having the same problem as i had with another one before and it's got that thong vibe and these bottoms like the elastic on them is like super like tight like doesn't really stretch very good and i always just remember feeling really tight on the hips when i wore this so i think it's gonna go because what the heck am i gonna match with this because it's so bright and neon oh this one's another one that i'm gonna get rid of and i definitely just needed to put some of the bandos in the to-go pile now i kind of got through like the ones that were close to me and i'm struggling to reach the other ones i gotta reorganize really quick get myself situated okay all right this is a lot better i have everything in front of me now and we can continue now i have this bright pink one kind of looks like clouds I, I don't really know if it was supposed to be clouds or tie-dye but she's cute it ties in the back and it kind of just has like that straight across shape to it i do like the design i just don't know if this is something i would pick out above other ones that i have again the bottoms just match i also really like how the sides are just the single string rather than being the same width as the whole bikini that's how a lot of mine really look so this one is really cute i think i'm gonna keep it but i don't know i found stragglers so these here don't have any matching pairs i just found them on their own and they're both tops so there's nothing i can really do with them this one is kind of cute it's just like a bubblegum pink type of color and it has the little tie in the front i feel like this is a single one that would be easier to match up this one i just it's just a no it's red like i said i struggle to kind of make red look good and it doesn't have any bottoms this definitely isn't something i have wanted to go for in recent summers so she's gonna go too okay this next one is cute it kind of gives that same tie-dye kind of vibe to it but it definitely has a different shape really love the color because it's kind of like 
faded pastel has like the scrunch tie in the middle so you can like adjust it to how kind of scrunched up or wide you want the middle to be which i really really love this one is super cute i'm definitely keeping it none the bottoms that match and i feel like i'm really vibing this year with the tie string sides or whatever you want to call them so i really like this bikini one of my faves so far so this next bikini is definitely another one i really like and want to keep because this bikini has a really cute color first of all it's got this like coral kind of pastelish pinkish orangish whatever you want to call it color and i really like it you can style this bikini i'm like struggling every time i'm sorry guys this is embarrassing you can style this bikini any way you really want because it's got that one that like it's got the back right here and then this so you can tighten this adjust this make this kind of like a strap whatever you want to do there's like a million ways to style a bikini like this you can definitely find some kind of video or tiktok showing you the different ways to style a bikini this way i just don't have the time to do that the bottoms have cute sides they are definitely super cheeky it's not i i don't want to say thong but it kind of is like a thong really do love the structure and the color and the top to this set so i'm just gonna have to deal with it when i wear that one the bottoms being really cheeky but it's okay i've seen worse so this one is cute i see the vibe it was going for and again it's got the rings on the hips which is something i kind of really like on a bikini i think it's super cute cheeky again but the top is really cute so it's got a much bigger ring in the middle which kind of separates the two sides of the bikini i'm just struggling with the cheekiness of the bottoms so i think i'm gonna put this in the debate pile so we're down to the last couple ones guys that went by way quicker than the clothes and my last video did and so we love that so i'm gonna do this one first because this is like the fourth uh tie-dye printed bikini that i have again this kind of looks like clouds especially this one because it's blue but i think i'm just gonna get rid of this one i don't know i'm not really vibing with the print all that much this one does look a little faded the bottoms have some pilling going on right here i don't know if you can see it but i hate when my bikinis do that so now we're gonna go back to the basics i have another plain black one bottoms of this do have some pink on the inside these are from victoria's secret i'm pretty sure but when you wear them you can't even see that obviously so i kind of just paired it with this random black bikini top that i had that didn't have any bottoms but this top is really cute and i'm pretty sure i got this from target like last year i think i'm gonna keep this last one too so the top is just like this and the triangles just have the cutest little ruffle at the bottom it just gives kind of like mermaid to me like i don't know like seashell vibes i don't know it's just like really cute and i love the pale kind of color to it i don't want to say nude it's kind of just like a really pale pink the bottoms are also super cute and have the ruffles all around and these are the only ruffle bottoms that i have so it's definitely gonna stay but that is all of them guys this one was definitely a lot more fun for me to film it was just a lot more relaxing and laid back and i love bikinis picking out and buying new bikinis and getting ready for the summertime is just so fun and the vibe is just like unmatched so definitely a fun video for me to film i feel super refreshed because now i've kind of gone through my whole wardrobe and got rid of sort of everything i really don't want i'm gonna try to sell some stuff or just give some stuff away i'm glad i got it done and i'm glad i shared it with you guys also because why not but yeah that's all i have for today's video so I hope you guys enjoyed it. I will definitely be getting some new bikinis for the upcoming summer because like I said, I haven't bought new ones in a really long time. Definitely show you guys and do a couple hauls. So stay tuned for that, like I always say. But yeah, that's all I have for today. I'll see you guys the next time I'm here. Bye.